health workers at Rustenburg's forensic pathology unit have downed tools. They say their health is at risk due to non-compliance with occupational health and safety requirements. Employees say they are forced to work without PPE even while performing autopsies. ENCA's Bafidile Moirane joins us from Rustenburg. Bafidile, good morning to you. I'm imagining that some family members um, who still have to do funerals might also be concerned about the story. Most certainly, which means that if this particular forensic pathology is shut down, as the union members are here, hospice are saying that they're closing it down with immediate effect, it's going to delay the arrangements for various families who were actually expected to bury their loved ones after an autopsy is performed because after the autopsy is performed from a forensic pathology, they are now released to be taken to their private mortuaries. So it's really a concerning situation, dilapidated structures uh, of this particular forensic, which is catering for the entire Bujanala, a stench of smell um, just when you enter here and also uh, just outside this premises, it's residential areas, businesses, other businesses that are operating here who are also really crying foul to say that for quite some time they are also being subjected to uh, this particular conditions. As you see in picture there, that's one of the uh, forensic pathology events that is being used by the workers here. They are saying that for the entire Bujanala district here in Rustenburg, uh, they only have about three vents and they also don't have equipment to service and among others um, the, uh, the body bags that they use they just tear apart easily, the stretchers are also dilapidated.